Virginia Tech traveling maroon. Pitt in the white. Opening tap controlled by the Hokies. We mentioned that game where she struggled against Syracuse, and so to see her trying to shoot early is a big deal, but on the other side, Asia Shepard, this is what she's known for. Trying to work on that baseline, deflected into the corner. King retrieved it, now she wants three, and that will drop. For such a, dif a, a difficult defensive assignment because you cannot be a step off of her. Panthers are on the board as Harris flies to the rim. Her ball handling is tremendous, and she can knock down shots. Nice passing in tight quarters over the front rim, Kitley. Damore was able to find Kitley, who finished off the play. That's behind the line and a miss. Second chance, Panthers. Off the glass and good. That's Brown. So Shepard is second of the conference in scoring, just over 19 points per game. And Kitley, who just made the pass unselfishly, inside for two, Baines. Yeah, the assists right here. Look at the point guard, just a freshman. But she sees the double come and finds her point or post player inside. And then Kitley sees Baines on the cut. Nobody on her. Never seen a more joyful head coach on the sidelines than Lance White. Taking steps in the right direction and driving to the rim and taking steps. They won two high school state championships in the Tar Heel State. Everett tries to shove wow. it on the rim. Stop it, Dale. <laughs> About what a great shooter she is. Look at her using the pivot foot and then falling over. Somehow still gets that ball to go in. Danny Brooks told us this is the first year he's ever put in a secondary break and they get something out of it. Tremendous asset. You know, Coach Lance White told us she didn't even get to campus before she committed. He had gone on a home visit. Nice shot there from Deja Green. Wow, the ball came right back to her. And we've seen Pitt take a lot of mid-range shots in this game, and somehow Brown got the shot over the extended arms of Liz Kitley. Going into next season is sitting outside, getting comfortable on that three-point line, because when you start developing that game and you've got to be defended out there, that changes things, and you've got to defend her out there. Kitley has barely been able to touch the ball on the post because Liz Kitley has defended it so well. Kitley, baseline jumper. And as we've mentioned, King with the ball right now and the jumper. Although that missed, she had 29 points. And that'll beat the horn on the putback. Avenge just a few days later with the win at home against NC State where Kitley had a double-double. Baines on the drive for two, and she's got five. Any level for that matter. I was on a plane with Billy Smith and Angelica just a few games ago, and it was delightful. Just incredible people. <laughs> Green thought about it again. Gave it to Amor. Money! Also just starting to get a feel for what else is open in the game. Not just her shot necessarily. And how about that one? Amber Brown got that to go with the contact. Between late December and mid-January because of pro COVID protocols. So they haven't played quite as many games as other teams, perhaps in the ACC, as Amor is on target for three. Try a shot out of the corner, and it's good Strother. Off the inbounds, Everett. She's got had a lot of those. Measure of time, and Everett drives into the paint. Strother, again out of that hot corner. <laughs> Panthers are one and three in their last four games. The win was last Tuesday at Clemson by 10. 79-69. Second win against the Tigers this season. Offensive classic. Inside out. But you've also got guards that can get into the paint as well. 14 points in the paint in the first half for Pitt. But there is Shepard. Welcome back after that long sit with the foul trouble. But how about that, Everett? Great answer. That was well off the three-point line. Now with 64 made threes on the season. There's some mid-range game. And the result is the same. And nobody ever accused Virginia Tech of that. Obviously, you've got Kitley and some great supporting cast around him. Brown hanging and scoring. Closing in on the seven-minute threshold of our third quarter. So glad that you're with us. Kitley, the turnaround on the block. Steps over, under, and around the defenders. And a chance to cut it to single digits for the first time since our score was 17-8. to eight.
That's Harris. And that started off of the good defense. Five or six from the line. Baines down the lane and scoring. Deserved a better fate there after the offensive board. You can tell that she just wants the ball. And how about that? We mentioned lack of threes from Everett, but... Pittsburgh will try to defend that three-point line as well as you can in a zone. Good execution there by Virginia Tech. Quick ball screen gets a more open. She's open again. Much better percentage and a much better look at the basket. Amor driving with a step and some daylight. Watch out. Kitley kicks it out. And I, I love the smile on, on Greg's face after she hit that shot. She knows that she gets, she doesn't get a lot of time on the floor, but she's doing well when she's out there. And another new set we're seeing on offense from Virginia Tech, and they finish. They had lost on January 24th by two to NC State in Raleigh. That'll be a three-pointer. Is that struggle? Yeah. For this club, but it does something to the confidence. You start believing in yourself a little bit more. Georgia Amor has an open lane to the basket as time expires. Wow. Struther, they came out to guard her that time with King. That'll just creep over the rim. Shepard with the entry pass. Kitley the follow away. How about that touch? Only one defender on her, and she'll score that every time. He's really incorporated that into her post play is the step back move, and Harris, another chance at the basket. I think she thought she was fouled on that one. And even though you had an opening, maybe you've got a better percentage shot somewhere else. Baines got her eighth rebound of the game at the other end. She'll get an assist on the shot by Shepard, and it's a three. Virginia Tech team is so difficult to guard because you're so worried about the paint. But then you've got these shooters. Harris driving and scoring Kelly Dale. <laughs> her out to the three-point line, make Kidley follow. There you go. And now the inside's open. Great play by Pittsburgh and a great finish by Harris. It's been Virginia Tech in front the entire way tonight. In the second meeting between the teams this season, that is Shepard with a competent release. <laughs> and it's three. Part of what he has has been doing at Virginia Tech and what he's trying to grow and continues to add great players to his roster. Way had been playing well the last three games. Andrew, Amber Brown is an undersized post player, but it's, it was almost non-existent. And how about the pass inside to Kitley? Nine of 23 from beyond the arc in the game for Virginia Tech. 74, 55.